at all these seagulls perched on the poles. Welcome to Taylor Treventures, your number one source for family travel information. And today I am so excited to tell you about one of my favorite cities of all time, and that is Detroit, Michigan. And you might be thinking to yourself, Detroit? Seriously? Seriously. It's awesome. And today I'm not going to talk about the whole city, although there are tons of amazing things that you can see in the city of Detroit, but I'm just going to talk to you today about the Riverwalk in the very center of Detroit. Detroit is located along the Detroit River and across the river from us is Windsor, Canada. And if you ignore Alaska, which I never do because I'm from Alaska, but ignore Alaska for a second. And Detroit is the only place in the United States where Canada is south of the US. If you look out across the Detroit River at Windsor, Canada, it's not like the best view. They probably have a pretty awesome view of us because we look amazing. It's not all that impressive from our side. <laughs> all along the river walk, you will find little benches, little pieces of artwork. It's completely paved, so you'll see a lot of bikers and walkers and runners, and it's just a really pretty, friendly atmosphere. I want to talk about some of the things on the river walk so that when you bring your families there, you know what to look out for. So if you go to the far east side of it, then there is a carousel for kids to ride on. There is a little playground there and a food court. And it's just kind of a fun little Eastern end point to that whole Riverwalk area. Super fun for the kids. And in the summer times, they also have like this little book reading thing on Fridays at 11, I think. And they give you a free book. They do like these singing, songs with the kids and you get a free ride on the carousel. It's really a fun community experience over there. And then if you walk west then you'll hit the Renaissance Center and right in front of the Renaissance Center is a fountain and that fountain originally was supposed to just be like for looks but they realized very quickly that there was no way they were going to keep the kids out of that fountain so they treated the water, changed the whole system so that kids could play there. And now during the summertime, it is a hot spot for families to go and relax, cool off, and the kids absolutely love it. If you go inside of the Renaissance Center, there is a whole showcase of beautiful cars there that they usually have set up there. I know during coronavirus, some of this stuff was shut down, so it may not be open just depending on what's going on in the world. They have this huge atrium. It's got Panera bread. And then if you go in a little further, it's got another food court. So there's delicious places to eat right there. And if you go like deeper on the second floor, you can find a pot bellies and mm, it's good. That is a good place to eat. There are also a lot of shops inside of the Renaissance Center. So if you're there and the Renaissance Center is open, I highly recommend just checking out the inside, seeing what kind of fun stuff there is there. This is also the headquarters of General Motors, which is why you'll find the little showing of cars. Especially if it's hot outside, it's a great place to duck into and give the kids a little break. Then if you continue going west, then you'll see this big ferry boat. It's to do like sightseeing tours up and down the river. Right by the boat, if you start going in towards the city, is a place called Hart Plaza. And Hart Plaza has all sorts of monuments and statues. A lot of them are in reference to the civil rights era. Detroit, as many people may not know, was a huge stop in the Underground Railroad because of its proximity to Canada. So it's got like this big monument um, with the names of people who helped with the Underground Railroad. It's got this huge like circle thing for equality. And then across the street from this is the fist of Joe Lewis, who is Detroit's boxing champion. The river walk in downtown Detroit is just one of the awesome things that makes up Detroit. I mean, there are so many cool things that you can do and see in Detroit. This is just one of the things, and this one's completely free and it is totally family friendly. Some other sites that you might want to check out while you're in Detroit are the Detroit Institute of Art. That's the art museum. They've got a children's science museum, which is really cool. And then there's just a lot of really cool architecture and churches there. Thank you so much for watching. If you like our videos, please, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. That really helps out our channel, helps us grow so that we can put out more amazing content for you. Peace.